What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to these NFL season predictions here today with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Now, the Buccaneers probably would have been a playoff team last year if Jameis Winston didn't throw 30 interceptions. They got rid of him, and then they got apparently one of the greatest free agency signings of all time in Tom Brady, and then they got Rob Gronkowski. Basically, people call him this the dream team. Yet, yeah, I do refer them to the 2011 Eagles and 2019 Browns. So, how do I think they'll do? Well, I think y'all know what the record is, but if y'all want to know what games I think they'll win and lose, here it is. Week 1, at the Saints. It's at the Saints. It's the home opener. Could be a game you win. If the Saints win this game, you'll win in Tampa. If you win this game, the Saints will win in Tampa. But I th I'm going to give it to the Saints here. I think that they will have a home field advantage. At least a little bit of one. I think that they should be able to win that game. You open up at home. Um, your home opener. First Carolina. I'm going to give you a win here. Carolina's rebuilding. We all know it by now. I think you should win this game. Week 3 at Denver. Brady always struggles at Denver. I'm giving it to Denver. Um, Tom Brady lost two AFC championships in Denver. And it's just whenever he goes to Denver, he never does that good. Week four, you host the Chargers call. If I ask me all you want, I'm giving the Chargers a win here. I think when you look at this game, Tom Brady always, you know, loses the games. He always loses, and it's not just one game. It's like two or three games that he is supposed to win, but he doesn't. I think that this is one of them. Week 5, at the um, Bears on Thursday night, I'm going to give you a win here. It's at the Bears, but I think that you have the offense just enough to pull out a win here. Week 6, you host Green Bay. I'm giving it to Green Bay. You're at home, yes. But you're hosting Aaron Rodgers. I don't think that you'll be able to get a win for some. I don't think your defense is going to be able to hold up. Week 7 at the Raiders on Sunday night. I'm going to give you this win here. Um, I don't think this should be a primetime game, if you're asking me. Um, I think that you will, however, get a win here. Might be one of your more bigger wins of the season, actually. Week 8 at the Giants on Monday night. I think this is a trap game. I think you lose this game. Call it eyes of me all you want. I think it's a trap game for you. You always have. Brady always has this trap game every year. I think this year, the Chargers and the Giants could be the main two trap games for him. Week 9, you host the Saints. I'm giving you a win here on Sunday night. Like I said at the beginning, if the Saints win in New Orleans, you'll win in Tampa, etc., um, vice versa, I think that, um, you should do enough to win this game, same thing at Carolina, I was really considering actually giving the Panthers a win here, but I am going to give you a win in Carolina, probably a close win, but I think you should do just enough to get a win there, now you're starting to build up a little bit of a winning streak, you are hosting the Rams on Monday night could be a game that you lose but I'm gonna give you a win here you're starting to kind of build up a winning streak Tom Brady knows okay I gotta win these games if I want any shot to get my team into the playoffs um week 12 you host Pat Mahomes I know you're hosting them but you'll lose this game your defense can't hold up for versus him week 13 so by week week 14 you host the Vikings Call advice to me all you want. I'm going to give the Vikings a win. Another trap game. I said two or three trap games a year for him. I think this is one of them. You know, Brady always loses games that he shouldn't. And I don't... This is a good defense in Minnesota in a pretty underrated offense. I think that Minnesota will win. Week 15 at my Falcons. I'm going to give the Falcons a win here. It's the same thing with the Saints. It's going to be vice versa. If the Falcons win in Atlanta, you'll win in Tampa Bay. If you win in Atlanta, my Falcons will win in Tampa Bay. Um, but I'm going to give the Falcons a win here. Too high-powered of an offense to at least to sweep them. 
Week 16 at the Lions. I'm going to give you a win here. You're saying there's a little shot to get into the playoffs. we got to win this game. I think you will. Then Week 17, you're hosting my Falcons. You'll win here, but it won't do a lot. So 8-8, eight and eight, I've been saying it all along, and I'm dead serious. I actually think you'll go 8-8. Eight and eight. When you look at this um, schedule, there are games that you could win. There are games that you could lose. I think that definitely the trap games you'll lose will be close games. But I don't think, I think that this experiment with Tom Brady is not going to work out real good. But that is going to do it for this video tomorrow. I will be back with the New Orleans Saints. Until then, peace out.